Our guest is the newest member of the Los Angeles City Council, sworn in August 2023. Representing Council District 6, we're happy to welcome Council Member Imelda Padilla to LA Currents. Welcome, Imelda. Glad you could join us. Well, thank you so much for having me. What have been the top priorities for you in District 6 that you have seen immediately? Well, I ran on a platform of seven topics with homelessness being at the top, public safety second, um, job creation third, fourth built environment, and then fifth was uh, parks, then libraries, and then an interest in supporting youth programming. And in the first three months, we've kind of tried to set the tone to get our feet wet with all seven, but mostly focusing on uh, the importance of homelessness very excited to announce um, and to have accomplished already hosting an Inside Safe in my district in partnership with Mayor Bass, uh, where we were able to get 40 plus individuals housed. Um, and that was an encampment that hadn't been touched for more than over two and a half years. Mm. And I've been very intentional about also uh, shifting outreach over to regions where we have uh, massive amounts of RVs. What makes it tricky is that some of these individuals don't consider themselves to be homeless they see the RV as their home. So we have to really think through those nuances. How have you earned the trust of the council, first off, but also your constituents? Well, the trust of my constituents, I like to think is something that I've been working on for multiple years, which is why I think I you know, won my election overwhelmingly with a 10 point lead, mm -hmm. is that people knew who I was. Um, people know that I'm a hard worker, people know that I care and people know that I pride myself on being accessible and in terms of my council you know it's it's one day at a time you know we have to work together because at the end of the day what I think all members of the council want to do is improve Los Angeles. CD6 is underfunded has been notoriously for many years are you working towards some things that will bring an infusion of money into your district? Absolutely so one of the things that I think was done um, very correctly and has benefited the community is that as land use decisions are made and new opportunities come for big job creators, sometimes we utilize the tool of a community benefits agreement. In my district, we have been able to do some of those. And now that leasing contracts are coming up out of the Van Nuys Airport, that is definitely a model that I am looking into because while these vendors on the airport are going to be generating millions of dollars as a job creator, it would be nice to uh, get a piece of that profit and immerse it back into the Van Nuys community. Very good. Council Member Padilla, thank you so much for joining us. We're glad to have you on. Thank you. Thank you.